Hey guys, welcome back to some more Legend of Zelda A Link Between Worlds. And we are now heading our way to Skull Woods. But uh, what are you picking up here? Uh, you know, we don't really need anything. But I feel like the bow has been here. You gonna buy it? Let's just buy the bow, right? Um, I feel like we lost it in like the Tower of Hera or something. Or, like haven't picked it back up. So we still have... So we're renting the boomerang and the tornado rod. Yeah, we'll we'll get those eventually, but we don't want to spend all our rupees in one place, you know. Yeah. So we've got the ice rod and fire rod still available. That means so all we've got left is skull woods, turtle rock, and the ice palace. Correct. Yeah. So we okay. have to pick up the rods. Yeah. Obviously. Yeah. Yeah. Well, we'll we'll get all all the rods. We'll get there. Um, we got a lot of my mys. What are you gonna upgrade? That, that's another great question. The like, bow? Should we do the bow? Yeah. Don't upgrade the boomerang. Bow, hammer, that's it. Oh. Well, so I guess the bow. Boomer. Uh, I was going to say hammer. Don't do it. All right. You want the hammer? Yes. All I right, want we'll the do, nice hammer. All right. We'll do that. I mean, eventually we'll get all this stuff, right? So. What does it do? Is it just like a bigger? Yeah, it's probably bigger. I want to I wanna see. Oh, it's like a spiked hammer. Nice, the hammer is more powerful now. Try. Should I? I'll equip it and maybe we'll. Yeah, I don't remember the effects that it has. We'll just use it a little bit. How many more? We okay. We got forty-four. All right. I like that song. That's pretty cool. It's like a deep. Uh... All right, let's. Uh, we'll equip. The nice hammer. Oh, it sends a shock wave. Is that what it said? Oh, is that what it said? Here, let's just like, give it a give it a quick shot on let's someone. Get those buzzes. Can you you can't charge it right? No. 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 Okay. So okay, so it creates like a little wave, so you don't actually have to hit the enemy anymore. Yeah. So um, now we have we can get to pretty much anywhere in the game. Okay. So at this point, I feel like like we've been doing the last couple, we'll just go like kind of no holds barred on getting the my mys. Okay. Whoops. Whoa! How'd I don't you... know what happened there. Uh, it, the one that got away. So for for doing this, I actually uh, did you plan out the course here? I, oh, there's I, one of the water, isn't it, right here? I think that might be in. Oh, yeah, no, there it is. One there. there she actually, is. Actually, um, what I did was we're, we'll get them in both the light world and the dark world. We're just gonna clear out this whole area. I believe it's low rule and high rule, but continue. <laughs> Thinking a link to the past here. Know your lore. But I actually, what I did was I got a little cheat sheet. Just oh. so we don't, just to make sure we get everything. We're using codes. I don't know. I don't know what the best route to do is. I guess we'll, we'll just uh, feel it out because they're kind of, you know, okay. kind of in a loop all over the place. So I'm pretty proud of the simplicity of that map because that was an in, in-game map that I used. Because I actually have. Like is there's it, one I around here. It. I don't remember where it is. That's gonna be. Oh, oh here it's it right is. there. It's on the. We're gonna be like literally hunting because I did. I looked at these and I, I did all of them. But uh, the problem is, we're gonna be uh, hunting high and low. All right, so we've got the cheat sheet ready, ready to go. We're gonna go up here and uh, get some more stuff. There's also some heart pieces we'll get in this. Ow! Now that you have the blue, ma like, now I think hero mode is no longer a challenge. Now I wouldn't say a challenge, but it's not the it's one of those things that it's a mu it's much it's not as threatening anymore now that you have both the 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 blue mail and the tempered sword and we got bottles with fairies so yeah I don't know if there will be another death in this run I mean you can always get you know careless and stuff so treacherous tower could be a little difficult oh sure it could be kind of treacherous I've never actually done that either so okay it's not terribly it depends on when we do it though. Like, if you want to go, like, into Low Rule Castle and get the Red Mail first. Oh, like, right. Like, that is suggested. Red Mail and Gold Sword are, I think, the the ideal way to ch challenge the Treasure's Tower. You gotta do it twice, too. Ooh, you gotta use the hook shot here, right? Yeah. <laughs> you gotta actually hit the... What's hit in the here? This, this is not money-making, no. Oh, this is a fun... Oh, he's the, got a rumor. The rumor guy here. You're that little goo... <laughs> <laughs> shooty chain thing looks fun um yeah so this guy i don't know he just kind of gives you a little bit of um 
Like is, here. is anything up here? Oh. You have to try to leave, and then he's like, he uh, tempts you with some rumors here. You got to pay for him now? No, no, he's just here, and he, you know, gives you some story details about people. So the witch, for example, he tells a story here about how the witch uh, has a crush on the fortune teller. Oh. Which is interesting, because when you're in low rule, and we went into the fortune teller's hut, the witch and the the fortune teller were together in that one. Okay. So, um, I don't know. That's a fun little bit of a, I don't know, backstory or something. Yeah, what else does he have so, to say? So, about? he's just, he, there's a lot of, uh... <laughs> Even tempts you. Yeah, there's a lot you can get here. The witch made, like, a, a, a love potion for the fortune teller. Okay. And then, uh... But I see, I see him at... Okay. So there's a lot there's a lot of back and forth here. The fortune I, I teller. only caught a few a little bit of it, so now I feel lost. Oh, the fortune teller then reads the witch's fortune and says that he does not re- return your affection whoever it is that likes you. <laughs> so That's ridiculous. He could not even tell he was looking at himself. Yeah. Um but yeah, you know, you can get a lot about they talk about we don't have to go through everyone, but uh like Zel- Zelda there's a story here that uh, she talks about. What is it for Zelda? In the prison, comes to a point where she has love on her mind, right? Oh yeah, we get a little bit of. Uh, Does she love Link? You didn't hear it from me, but every night the princess no, goes on actually. a little excursion inside the castle. Her maids say that she's secret meaning. Apparently, she's not a very good at the secretly part. I need to know. So what? Uh, <laughs> Crashing decided to follow the princess. And guess what happened? <laughs> Yawn. I don't want to <laughs> say that. in front of a large painting on display in the center of Hyrule Castle. And she stood there just staring up the painting for ten minutes. Then went back to her room and just like that. First of all, I went to inspect the painting. You'll never guess what happened. <laughs> <laughs> Cuddling in one. Hmm. Link from uh, old Link? Is there a painting of Link and Zelda cuddling in this game? Someone might know. But, uh, yeah, apparently that's a little bit of detail about Zelda. She's into Link from A Link to the Past. So even Princess Zelda from this game knows A Link to the Past is the better game. <laughs> the other there's, there's one other story. It talks about Gramps. You know, the character. He's just like a random character in a Kakariko Village, which... Uh, people have now like the- like made up all these theories about how he's like an older Link or something like that. Okay. He talks about how Gramps like does handstands and is super athletic and stuff like that. Okay. And yeah, people have speculated. You can find all these like Gramps theories online and stuff. It's it's kind of fun. Oh, we got fifty one. Yeah. So-, so there's one other Mai Mai around here somewhere. Ooh, we want that treasure chest though. That's got, uh, yeah, what do that's you think? not silver rupee, no way. Purple rupee. Red, Red rupee. rupee. Ooh. Ooh, what a downgrade. Red rupee. Here we go. <laughs> Does that clear the area? Clear it? I think we have one more just south, which we'll hit up right now. Okay, out of the woods. Out of the woods, yeah. Into the woods. Oh, back in, it's back, uh, the entrance that's in Kakariko Village. So right up here. So after that, I think we'll have all the Mai Mais in uh, the whatever you call this area. The, the Kakrika Village slash Lost Woods portion of the world. Yeah, let's let's double check here. We still haven't touched. Look at all that zero. It's like half the world is over. Yeah, it's or, sad. You know, over. I don't know. If that... <laughs> well, let's, you know, don't lament too much because we, we got the low rule section. So Yeah, we're only about halfway done with the, the Mai Mais overall. <laughs> Oh, yeah, that's fair. There's a bunch of Death Mountain, too, that we'll eventually get to. I don't like Death Mountain in this game. No, I'm not a big fan of that whole section leading to Turtle Rock. To uh, the Ice Palace, you mean? Or, yeah, Ice Palace, yeah. sorry. Yeah, I was though. thinking of A Link to the Past. <laughs> yeah, it's not as... Uh, it's slow. We'll get to that later. So this uh, this is one we get a bit from Hilda here, but it's about the... Oh, I see a heart piece. <laughs> Love doing that, but this area isn't like there's not like a lead up to the dungeon like in some of the other areas. You know what I mean? 
Right. Like, you don't have to do anything. You just have to, like, go to the dungeon. Yeah, you can just enter it right now. Yeah. Oh, you know what? Let's switch to my low rule cheat sheet. Fantastic. I guess it's because Skullwoods in of itself is kind of quirky a little bit. It's not like a traditional dungeon. Okay. So that's probably why that's know, they, fair. They, they went that route. Yeah, I guess that's I fair. That guy's going to hit you. Oh, whatever. Oh, let's see. That took four hearts of damage. Yeah, these guys are pretty tough, but you know what? They drop. They make sure to have them drop red rupees. Because oh, I think. Do they always drop red rupees? Those guys do, yeah. I think they're expecting, like, if you die, you know, you can have money to buy your stuff back at least. Okay. There's what we're well, that makes sense, about. yeah. Because rupees are you know, the main currency here. Yeah. <laughs> rupees, like, we're not. It's more important in this game than any other Zelda game, I'd say. Yeah. We're not, like, hurting for them, but, you know, it could be worse. No. Yeah, don't. Okay, come on, dude. You want to use a weapon? Oh, yeah. You don't like using your weapons, do you? I just don't think about it half the time. What do you got? You got to... I don't know what the Should we use shot. that hammer? We yeah, yeah, try the hammer against these guys. Smash this guy? Oh. That just... Yeah, that hammer looks pretty OP. I like it. Get out of here. I don't <laughs> even care about them. The popos? The uh, ropos? No, these are pop... Whatever they... they... Whatever they're called. <laughs> that one? Okay. Look, they got little tentacles, like, all slimy looking. So how are you feeling about the Mai Mai's, uh again? Like, we, good collectible? Uh, yeah, I think they are. There's just the right amount of them. You know, we're kind of, it's kind of casual here what we're doing, but... uh, We're, we're like montaging our way through. You gotta... <laughs> this is a heart piece here. Are you ready for on it? The, on the roof? Uh, that's awesome. That, that's that's fantastic. Those are not kukos. They're, they're like death kukos. And then there's a Mai Mai around here somewhere. I forgot where. Is on the back wall there? No. It's not loud enough here. Ooh, hearts, though. Follow your ears. Is it in one of these bushes? Whoops. You have to dash into that bush, maybe? Oh, probably this. There we go. I'm not even paying attention to this guy. Some of them, it's funny, because some of them, it's like you see them on the tree, and then sometimes it's like you got to dash into the tree. Yeah. It's like, okay. <laughs> if that's how you want to do it. Um, so the music doesn't change here. No. So Link to the Past, this plays the Dark Death Mountain theme. Yeah, what What do you think's up with that? Uh, I don't know. Just why, why have gotta, it? Ooh. This guy, the so mysterious man. So they finally man. sent a rescue party. Hey, wait, you're no party. You're just a kid. Let me guess. You came in here looking for some extreme fun <laughs> in the great outdoors, huh? I'm pretty extreme. Yeah, I've been running crazy in these woods, running till I got dizzy. Trunking. I call it trunking. I trunked and trunked around these trees <laughs> until I finally lost my way. Been sitting here ever since. But I found a great treasure in the woods. Maybe you'd care to take it off my hands? It's a little something I picked up when I got stuck. I just decided to keep it. Okay. How's 888? Buy it. Oh, we need oh. an empty bottle. All right, we'll empty. We'll lie. Uh, if it's an if it comes in a bottle, you know this is not a good reward. No, but yeah. let's let's see what it is anyway. I think he's gonna sell you a B. A B? I, I, my interest is peaked. A gold, gold B. B. Not a good B. A gold B. Be careful. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So you ripped us off a bit. Maybe. I mean, what? A, we're gonna have to use the gold B at some point, right? Yeah. I'm gonna. I don't want to accidentally use it. You know. Don't. Wanna... You can catch it after you use oh, it. Oh. Okay. Yeah. I, I, well, that's how it worked in the length of the past. But. Gotcha. Hey. It was called. Oh, you just killed a bee. No, that was not <laughs> the bee though. It was the good bee, right? In yeah. The length of the past. Yeah. Um. <laughs> should, should we try it on on an enemy? Yeah. Let's. Uh, you know they get the get the um, net ready. Oh, in, in okay. Case you okay. Catch it. Ready for this. This is going to be an 800. Wait, can, is there any enemies in this area? You know, this might not be the safest place because it might go to an area that we can't get to. Oh, this area goes back to Kakariko. There's no... You know what? We'll... we'll uh, there's some good rooms, you know, in the dungeons. They have, like, the rooms where it's, like, defeat all the enemies. Yeah. We'll, we'll use it in the dungeon. That'll be yeah. a good spot for it. It'll be some good being there. Yeah. 
I actually think... Is it time to go to Skullwoods? I actually think so, yeah. Let's take a look here. Did we get yep. all... Zeros again, so... We've cleared the region. I yeah. like how there's that one path that leads from the bottom left to the northeast. Ah, this guy. Here. Hammer him, hammer him. No, you know what? Yes! Okay, the okay. bee is not doing much. He doesn't do much, but he... Capture him. <laughs> that was really... He's like a companion. That's oh, good. God, it says this every time. Oh, man. Well, it's still pretty satisfying, you know? Yeah. It's... There's a lot of bees. <laughs> this, is, this is like a, I guess, you know, bees in the in the forest. Why not? So that's gonna do it for this video. Yep. Join us next time, and uh, here we are at the entrance to one of the top five woods. <laughs> Absolutely. See you guys next time.